Hi, Incidents. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I am reacting to Young and Sulgi's Rose. Um, I'm so excited. I literally love anytime Young puts a song out on his SoundCloud. I know it's going to be magnificent. I literally listened to Blue like three times today because I just, that song resonates with me so much. Um, and his other songs are absolutely fantastic. Um, Dark Clouds, GTA, all of those. So good. Um, his last collaboration that he did, of course, we know was Monroe with Bacon. I mean, literally, what more could you ask for? It was as phenomenal as I thought it was going to be. So I'm really excited um, because not only do I love Taeyong, because I mean, we all love and cherish our fantastic leader who manages to take care of 22 kids, um, plus still managed to have time for himself. Um, but we also have Sulgi, who is happens to be my red velvet bias because I absolutely love her. She's a phenomenal dancer, phenomenal vocalist. Um, so I'm really excited to see what this song sounds like. But before I start, I kind of wish like Young had the freedom to like write and produce like one, one, two, seven track. I think that would be really cool. I think he would have like to see him have all the options of what he could do with each one of their voices because they're so different and unique from one another that I think he would produce a phenomenal song. Um, so I think that would be really cool to just like see him, see what he could do with like one, two, seven. Cause I mean, I mean what he does by himself and in collaborations uh, has been amazing. So with that being said, I'm really excited to get into Rose. So let's get started. Jumping through the rock up I sure as I'm not talking a lot, but uh, I just feel like I'm really vibing with it. I'm 
I love Taeyong's singing voice. Also, both of their voice just fit so well together. Yo, that was good. That was really good. Oh, but like I wouldn't expect anything less from Taeyong. Like Taeyong, it's Taeyong. Taeyong is so unreasonably talented. Like an, an ace. Taeyong is Taeyong is an ace. Um, but uh, I just I love to hear this type of music from him. It's I wish I had the lyrics with me, um, but I'll definitely go look for them after this, um, after I get done with this video, but I'm just like, I didn't even realize like I, I wasn't talking, like I forgot that I was shooting a video and needed to, to like say something. Um, so, but it was, oh, so good. I would, and their their voices just fit so well together because like sometimes if you do a collaboration and like the vocal tones aren't like not cohesive there's a word I'm trying to think they don't just like match together very well and there's kind of some like dissonance I want to say um I don't know if that's the right word I'm thinking of either but it's not gonna sound as good, but I feel like both of their uh, voices just meshed so well together. Um, and I've always like I've lo I loved Silky's voice. Um, I think the first time I like got introduced to it was um, when Mark did High School Rapper, and she like joined him for his final. Um, uh, performance and that was like when I like I hadn't just gotten into NCT but it, I was still like fairly new to NCT so I hadn't branched out into like Red Velvet and all that yet um, but I was like oh my god she's amazing and so that's that's when I got into Red Velvet and all that um, but I I love this song um, it's gonna go I like have a spot or I'll just like I usually don't, the only person I listen to on Spotify is Taeyong, so um, I literally like got a Spotify account to listen to Taeyong's music. Um, so I'll just go in with with my other Taeyong Tae songs that I listen to, which is literally like every single one that he's put out, um, and listen to this song. If y'all haven't like, if you have a SoundCloud and haven't followed Taeyong, which I don't think you would, especially being an in citizen. Um, but like, go follow Taeyong. Tell him he did amazing. If you have Taeyong's bubble, tell him he did amazing. Um, and I figured this, we were going to get a new song because he kept consistently posting Rose pictures on his Instagram. And I was like, when that happens, Taeyong's about to drop a masterpiece. So, um, I, I, I thoroughly enjoyed this. Like it was, it was great. I don't really have like much else to say on it. Um, but I mean, it's Taeyong and we love and adore Taeyong more than anything. Um, and I'm glad he's getting to like, since they have a break, um, well, I say they have a break um they're starting on their new album, or at least I'm assuming they're starting on their new, or in the middle of their new album, wherever they are in their process. Uh, but at least he has time to like do his own thing with his music. Um, and he's sharing it with us. So I really, I really do appreciate him for that. Um, especially knowing Taeyong, this song probably also has a very like 
deep meaning for him because I know he pours a lot of his emotions into his songs. And I think that's why I like Blue so much because I feel like it, it resonates with me. Um, and I'll just like sit and listen to that song and like drift off into a different place. Uh, but that's just, that's Taeyong's effect with his music. And so I wish he would like, I wish they would let him do stuff for, and I know he's like very big in like the recording process. Like he'll go in and like listen to other people and kind of give advice on how they, how he thinks they should sound. Um, but like, let him, let him produce a 127 track with like all of them. So, um, but I really enjoyed the song. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. It was more kind of more, a more chilled reaction. Uh, but I feel like that's kind of Young's uh, effect. So it's just, his music's very chilled, very, um, puts you in like a good mood to just like vibe. So, um, but be on the lookout for my next NCT content. Hopefully I'll put out some stuff that I've already recorded and just like haven't, uh, edited yet. Um, so be on the lookout for that and I will see you guys next time. Bye.